Alrighty guys, um, here I am. My name is John Edward Wardlow III. <laughs> I'm uh, ready to start up this shading and lighting class with Maya. Um, I'm here to demonstrate my understanding of the basic skills and whatnot. So here I'm going to open up Maya for you guys. Make sure I can get all this. I know you guys, um, I know you guys want me to, you know, destroy this and, you know, reset it. Um, I like to work in modeling standard. I'm going to go and I know you guys said you wanted a plane. Pop that out there. I need this to be in transform. So I might make the plane as big as possible. Because I know this needs to be the largest. Make a square, or a square, don't judge me, cube, sorry. And then make that large as well. Um, what's the uh, W? Bring this up. Use Alt and left click to move up and down, or move up and around. And then, I know you guys, oh, I do Alt and scroll, mouse scroll to go in and out. I also um, use the Alt and right click to, you know, move in and out. Um, I'm going to get a circle. Oh my lord, I am just destroying this. A sphere. <laughs> and I I'm gonna pull this here. I know it needs to be the smallest object. So I'll make it like that big. Um, we're going to move like here. And then pull this down like halfway. So it looks like a little observatorium type deal. And there we are. There is my plane and objects. Now, I know you guys said you wanted a wireframe. I know you also said you wanted a wireframe on top of shaded. So there we go for all of those things. Um, I don't know why it's not going on top of the cube, honestly. I'm sure I will learn that though. That's when the entire point of this process, right? And then I know you guys want the channel box. Where is my channel box? Oh wait. Well, this is the attribute editor. I know you guys wanted the, you know, the attribute editor to show where that is. Um, I'm trying to find my... I think it's just because I'm in modeling standard. If I go back here, I'm sure it'll find... Yeah, there we go. I click that, you know. You can mess with these options, change the scale and whatnot. I learned that. But take this back to 15 because that's what it was at and then yeah this is uh my maya tutorial or my maya experience rather is really all i know how to do um a lot of my uh lessons in 3d modeling were just to you know build a house or build a a, a door you know and then we would put the we pretty much just like built a bunch of little things to start off and then we put all the little things together and to make it into a house you know so yeah uh i like maya though maya's fun it reminds me uh kind of like super uh super advanced spore i used to play spore when i was like a super nerdy little kid but yeah thank you guys for uh listening I will stop this recording. That is the wrong thing.